I, I will not hesitate to tell you this that Baka in the Navafilwa. Navafilwa. The man has failed. I know there are some people that are still talking to say, no, uh, whatever he promised, he, it has just been only one year. He has got whatever, whatever, whatever. Come on, guys. Let's be real. Let's be real. One year is a long time to at least fix something. Yeah? To at least fix something. Muri one year, at least work in the HDM. Gana wachita ku fix fimo fimo. You would have fixed at least something that we can be looking at. But what has he fixed? What has he fixed? We are now getting to almost one year, six months. That's why we are getting. Hmm? So now the color, the time that Haka in the HDM has stayed is long enough for him to have to have changed a number of things. Haka in the HDM doesn't give us hope. He doesn't. There is no hope muri baka in the even you mwebale 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 katirira kwati ni lunch wa chimpoena eh some of you are holding on to present aka in the chirema imwe ba 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 roid eh ba roid muleya na bambya bashala you are holding on to aka in the chirema nga lunch wa chimpoena hmm? like a tick holding on to a dead dog that's you there is no hope there is no hope so the only way according to me as Trifatari, in my opinion the public lawyer i'm saying vaka in the hrma just resign i'm done just resign because we can't wait for 2026 we can't wait for 2026 to allow for to allow for to allow for to allow for now, there is suffering in Zambia. Whoever can say whatever, whatever, there is suffering. You can talk about statistics. You can talk about what. You can bring all the lies of Haka in the HDM. The reality is that people are suffering in Zambia. People are suffering. And because people are suffering, I'm really saying, Haka in the HDM, Zwa. Haka in the HDM, Kamuya. Can we have somebody else to come in can we have somebody else to come in we can't go on like this we want we to allah there is no hope don't be cheated you people don't be cheated that yo no 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 think we are going nowhere we are going nowhere i can run you through I can run you through. Me, I don't just make statements anyhow. I back my statements. When Wahaka in the Ichilema was in opposition, he had a well outlined plan, the 10 points plan. Give me that 10 point plan and show me one thing that Wahaka in the Ichilema has done in one year. At least he would have done something. At least he would have done something. Imo Bonsi wa Mweba Resa Pota Wahaka in the Ichilema here. Therefore, Mulembe. Mulembe. Start writing. I'm even feeling like. It opening a phone line so that you can call and tell me to say this is what he has done i will do it maybe tomorrow i will introduce phone in so that you can call and tell me right now therefore i remember the support of haka in the mulembe pofimo apart this is what haka in the chilema has done mulembe pofimo i i eh ababale baba now at free education you are now let me tell you that free education you are talking about is 200 kwacha. It's 200 kwacha to a lady pillar. But kind of HDM wa fumia kofi kuri free education in Mulanda but free education is 200 kwacha. The imbiwata uri pidirava na you maybe you might not be paying for children. Some of us will pay for children. We have people that are going to different schools. So we know it's basically 200 kwacha. 200 kwacha. Now, if you look at the 200 kwacha, Compared to the misery that President Daka in the HDMA, what is 200 kwacha? What is 200 kwacha? I would rather, I would rather have fuel at 17 kwacha where Ed Galungu left it. Ed Galungu left fuel at 17 kwacha. I would rather have fuel at 17 kwacha and I'm paying that 200 kwacha in schools. I would rather do that than to have your free education in Urela and the 200 kwacha and yet, I am paying more on fuel. I'm spending more on fuel. I would rather pay 200 kwacha 
for my children and my nieces and my nephews to go to school than to pay 200 kwache sakari avunga. I would rather pay 200 kwacha than to have this long load shedding that is coming, that we, we are being subjected to. I would rather pay 200 kwacha and be rest assured that when my mother goes to the hospital, to the hospital, she will find medicine. I would rather pay 200 kwacha if at least with that 200 kwacha, jobs can be there. I would rather pay 200 kwacha if money is in the pockets of the people. So you can't tell me about that 200 kwacha. It's nothing. It's nothing. It doesn't mean anything. From there, let me tell you, right now as we are talking, as we are talking, Imwe, that money has not gone to schools. Schools are being inconvenienced by that 200 kwacha. Right now we have opened the schools. Schools have not received their grants. Children are going to school. Children are going to school. But the, the schools have not received their grants. What is happening to you? Now, Minister, we know who Minister of Agriculture, who Minister of Education, what is happening? Now, HHV, does he even know? The grants are not going to schools. That 200 kwacha has brought problems for schools. They have brought problems. And they are failing to give quality education. And you see what Hakainde Ichirema has done? Now, Hakainde Ichirema, Bantua Nikane, Ba PF, they allowed people to progress from grade 7 to grade 9. Now, because Hakainde Ichirema wants to reduce, wants to reduce the number of children in schools, he, they have reintroduced this exam where people are going to be failing now. Bakainde, PF wanted free wanted people to progress. But they have, they have introduced now this so that where will they go? Eh? Where will they go? So we are going to have so many so many children out there. At least for PF, they were allowing people to progress. I am my exams which they introduce. It is to reduce on the numbers. So I would rather they pay 200 kwacha. Our children start progress. I know, yes, uh, some of them uh, may not do very well, may not do very well at the end of the day, but at least they would be enlightened. They will know something than them being outside. I would rather have somebody in school than somebody outside school because the school, he, he has failed to progress to the next grade. It is unacceptable. So finishi, if you want to learn that you are kind of the man of a chita, eh? Abo imo ba given man psati uri chipuwa, eh, which uri chipuwa. Tell me what he has done. Don't tell me the chipuwa. Tell me what you are kind of the man has done. Tell me what he has done. Tell me what he has done. At just pay your rentals. Ba 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 Lusaka TV at Lusaka TV. Ba Edgar Lungu ba to share we know such that the issues of rentals now is not an issue. Wish kunsh mama nende anda pati ishkwe tamar rentals. Wish kunsh, eh? Because Edgar Lungu created a facility where some of us were able to make money and sort out some of these problems. Actually, if anything, praise singer. You praise singers are the ones who are suffering. You are suffering more because you are thinking that Akain Dei will come and help you. Unfortunately, nothing has happened. So anyway, in I'm saying Akain Dei must go. That's what I'm saying. Akain Dei Chirema must go. He must resign. He must resign. And I'm calling upon you Zambians. To start calling for Haka in the Ichirema to resign. Opo muamu mwona mwapunda resign. Muamu mwona resign. Mwapunda resign. Mpakachi te resign. Let him resign. Munga mwamu mwona vaka in the Ichirema. Resign. Resign. So that achi te resign umuntu yu. Nafir wa. Te titura ikari da. Te titura ikari obu fi yo. Ubu fi mwaba haka in the Ichirema. Tatu wakabuli ya yo. We will never feed on. President Akainde Ichirema's lies. We will never. 
he must resign and we must start calling for it you don't fear at your vale kwikata ah ah it's democratic just as it is democratic to endorse him to say we want haka in the it is also democratic to to say no we don't want him mwamfo mufu ikishebu ino wino sana just as it is democratic to endorse somebody it is also democratic to disappoint somebody it is also democratic to cast a vote of no confidence it is a democratic right it is don't fear at nonga tanda tio haka inde chirengi makabie at yo muland te mulandu it is democratic and we must amplify the voices of calling for haka inde chirema to resign why must he resign why haka inde chirema must resign number one, in terms of in terms of if mitengo shafinto the prices of commodities haka inde chirema has messed it up he has messed up the commodity prices therefore of sangile this is not how he found things you can say no 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 he he, he, he just came in look if haka inde chirema really was capable if he was not inefficient he would have maintained the status quo of things he would have maintained but since he came in everything has gone up gone up gone up so how better is he from edgar lungu how better is he if when he came in he found milimil at 130 kwacha today uvunga buli 200 kwacha and by the way mumfu ikishe by the way this is not a prophecy uvunga walambo kushota milimil prices is going to even increase because we will have a shortage of milimil we will have a shortage of milimil ubunga walambo kushota why ishire sawa ila fie aba bana ni kanelo ba ishire ba UPND mufikisha bwino bwino sana ile ba ishire ba UPND bali sangira mataba una ni kane mu FRA they found stocks of maize piles of maize when they came in from the farming the farming season of 2019 2020 2019 when they came in they started selling uvunga they have been exporting they have been exporting and i'm challenging fra to come in and tell us what are the stocks kuna nkane ku fra can they tell us what are the stocks what are the stocks you ba media and whatever whatever mairo muka ku fra and ask them what is the stock what stock do they have because these people have been selling minimum they have been exporting bena ba ishwa fi okushitisha and as it is we will have a shortage of maize and when we have a shortage of maize it will mean that the the minimum prices will increase minimum prices will increase ili pali 200 kwacha it is going to increase even to be more there is a worry because we don't have stock we don't have enough stock i should say we don't have enough stock so be careful so the point is edgar lungu ashiru obunga pali 130 ababa aka inde ichirima obunga buli pali 200 ero bulekwela buchiri buleya talk about you talk about uh, cooking oil how much was cooking oil when by edgar lungu was living eh cooking oil when by edgar lungu was living was between 80 to 120 lelo ni shinga ili kuma 200 ja kutuku eko iti eh 200 ja kuti so if into nothing in look at a eh, 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 akasa ka, ka sugar ba head galungu ba shinga, shinga pali sugar eh lelo sugar is almost 50 kwacha everything has gone up so if things have gone up how can you say vaka in the hlema is is better than valungu and fine okay he has just been in power for one year now let's turn it around do you think it is fair that since vaka in the hlema came in within this year things have gone so high where we have fuel that he found at almost 17 kwacha it is now at 28 kwacha do you think it's fair muri one year Fuel ya 17 kwacha yafika kuri 20 kuri 28 kwacha do you think that is normal for you imomwe wale but no it just one year it is just one year your gift changala 
ulianza at 190 190 unto shita people who are in different areas they will tell you kuchi ngola uwunga would in over 200 eh in other areas uwunga would in avaleshana pali 210 so you 190 olela ndaka tisho ko shita you you haven't seen the price tags where it is more than 200 hmm? so here this is why i'm calling baga inde kuya i'm saying vale i'm calling for him to go because first of all the price of commodities have gone high and if you are saying no baga inde ichile has only been in power for one year my 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 response to you is that do you think it is okay for baga inde ichile for the time that he has been there to increase prices of commodities to where they are today do you think it is okay it is not okay it shows incompetence it shows failure let him resign let him resign 